Ladies and gentlemen, there is something important that I would like to talk about. Tim, would you mind leaving for a while? Tom? Okay. I will sit down in oversized looking normal chair. Where's the coffee you offered? Yes, I have to type it in the chat. Yes, I, I can twist my head right round, baby, right round. Yes, I want coffee. I have acquired coffee. I am not drinking coffee, I am just slamming it to my face. I can shake my coffee to mix it without a spoon. I am not drinking coffee, I am slamming it against my face. This is stupid. Is there anything you'd like to know? Hmm. Advice. Wise man Marcus, tell me you're with... with... Th 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 dumb. Advice for what? A great wisdom ability to wise. Mm -hmm. Tricky subject for myth hunting. You look like myth hunter. I don't feel like drinking coffee. It is 40 degrees hot. I do not like the myth hunters. Okay, bye. I do not be here then. Wait. I remember I am not myth hunter. I am art critic. They never obey my rules. Oh, okay. Will you obey my rules? No. <laughs> mm, okay. I will not obey your rules. And just don't let my cat you disobeying them, okay? I shall disobey your rule right now. Allow me to... Uh, place my cup too far to the corner of the table. Oh no, so dangerous. Oh, he spilled my coffee. I spilled the coffee, but that was on purpose. I'm also going to slam my cup against the window because it looks breakable. I spile coffee. Where? Here. I put it too close to the corner of the table. Never mind that, I'll clean it up. Get angry at me, god dong it. Would you like a refill? No thanks. Okay. What is up here? Tim? <coughs> Have you met him yet? Yes. No. Huh? No. I want to further investigate. Would you mind introducing yourself? No. I will not introduce myself. I want to break every rule. I will go down the basement and- No. I will not introduce myself. Do you know who I am? I have 40 subscribers. I am big. Are those barrels have something in them? I hate TV. I want to look at the grass. The grass go. I want to walk down old timey place and enter basement because game change. This is the place where dad lies. Oh no, this is kinda bad, but that doesn't matter, I want to break every rule in the games. Because I am Flynn, I am hero person from favorite anime, time for adventure, saving my favorite Twitch thought from evil president P.I.S. Because he is pervert, and I am less pervert than him, but I am still pervert because... Why would you go in? Yeah, I said I could go in. Call the psych. A witch of greed. You witch of greed. How dare you? What? I do not understand. You witch of greed. He told me to tell you that. 
You are a witch of greed. I am not a witch though. <laughs> no. You are a sheep, sake. Remember of me suffering on the rocks? Oh, oh yes. Stop moving, I want to put my mouse on your title text. I climb down there and who is workspace? I want to cross Western Canyon. What is down there? Come back inside, please. No. <laughs> Mom fell down here once too. She never came back up. No. Oh. Okay, so I was just casually going about my myth hunting until an old man came and asked me for a story in the messages section. And I was like, okay, I'll tell you a story. So I wrote a mildly long story, and here's how it goes. Ahem, <coughs> the sign just stood there, standing, big and red with a large heading that could be seen all around the building reading does hot dog stand is become stupid i was no expert in the legendary arts of the sign rule following but at first glance i could at most tell me that the sign was telling me that hot dogs were somewhat bad but i won't give up now not after all of this adventuring of internet comedies and Bad room reviewing. I asked the sign, Who are you? What do you want from me? But the sign just stood there, blowing in the mild breeze of the warehouse of boxes containing nothing but wheat flavored popsicles, emitting such a stench of rust and towers of sweat crawling up my legs. Hmm, this is bad. After all of this adventuring and all I got is I does hot dog standees become stupid? This can't be. I was hoping for a legendary dog hot, like a hot dog, but the bread and meat is swapped. This was it. I have had it with this stupid sign labeling a somewhat strict rule as does hot dog standees become stupid? I must rebel. Or else I won't acquire the dog heart. And so, I henceforth summon my most greatest summon in my summon arsenal. Come forth, step sign shaped in the form of famous celebrity. Old guy with a shiny forehead. And I blasted the sign with hateful messages such as BBBQBQBDQ and <coughs> The sign is dead. Refreshed. I woke up to hot dog stand, person running it staring at me, cross-eyed, and in my utmost politest words, I asked for the dog hot, and upon obtaining it, I took a bite. Disgusting! The end. And so I sent a message to the old man, and today, or a very long time ago, depending on when you're watching this, but today, I got that message. Reply from him, he say it's very stupid. I was like, yes, I do not intend to write any capital letters in story because that will break my fingers. Now you may be asking yourself, what is this place? Well, you see, mentality, that, that myth from the, that myth from the myth video, that guy whose diary I completely destroyed, I found the basement thingy. Is this the basement thingy? It is. Well then, where's the secrets? Give me the secrets. Ah, the secret door. No, see, no, see, no, no. Leave. You're not allowed in my secret room. I should shut the door now. No, see. Boop. Oh, I locked them in. Did I just get locked inside of my own secret room? The door. <laughs> <laughs> he invited me to his friend's myth group, and I was like, okay, then he also offered me an office, and I was like, oh, okay, just make sure to add cabbages, loads and loads of cabbages, especially iceberg, or not really cabbages, but lettuce, I find them the same thing though, the group, it has, it has ranks, and it has people doing stuff, and they say you can rank up via shout, but how does one 
but shouts are only available for people of a certain high rank. And that is confusing. How does one rank up with a shout if there is not even a shout? So they pop down an interrogation room. They pop down an interview room. And I am simply just exploring interview room. What is inside? Oh, elevator does not work. This reminds me of S C P land. Okay. I need to be. It was your fault. Oh, hey. Door open now. Now, about episode 23. I've changed my mind. After a discussion with a god of myth hunting on the comment section, I realized that this myth sucks because of the whole building. But you know what? I kind of don't care. I'll finish my document and then I'll pack up and go home. Three, four, four, oh, four. Sick. I'm not gonna go to the exit, I'm gonna go down a dark hallway. Key card acquired. What do you mean? There is no need for key card. What is this place? Oh, seven, seven, two. Oh, okay. This place was mildly useless. But this place has transparent window. Test. A tentacle slaughter. This is a test that has many points in it. We tested a person who was engaged in a slaughter of 45 children and 4 elderly. We injected him with a virus named Shore Menu. When the virus spread, though he body, he waited 5 hours until something unexpected happened. The person suddenly disappeared whilst a figure with tentacles as arms and head suddenly. The earth became too hot that now it is a magma ball. Oh, okay. Is this related to the big demon that was summoned? It mildly depresses me. Future Dark Meanings is a bit confusing as a myth. Apparently, according to the RMH, a myth, a good myth, is supposed to make good games not be very self-centered. I don't think the self-centeredness was much of the problem, it was more the quality of the myth's games. The codes aren't very clear, the game layout obviously is terrible, like the style of building, but somehow he succeeded as a myth. That's a bit confusing for me. It's interesting really. Oh, what does this box block say? Clue? Wall? Is this wall? Wally, why is this wall here? Why is there an invisible wall underneath it? I am going to walk forwards on the path on heaven and my camera moves through the invisible block and it's very scary. Ooh. But I want to read what strange sign in the sky says to uncover minor detail in way of robe. Because I am Flynn, Hero Manan 57, and I save my favorite Twitch streamer. I just want to get accepted to be a real myth, but they're right. I'm just a random dead joke. Let me give you some advice, pal. 1. Be active. 2. Make better games. 3. I don't really have much of a problem with the use of free model, as long as it's used for a good term and not too often. That's part of advice too. 4. Don't be over dramatic. Or, uh, to be a myth, you gotta be, you gotta join myth groups. Then you gotta get the myth groups to become bigger, then you join more myth groups, you be known more to the community, get the attention of YouTubers, get even bigger, because an owner of a myth hunting server that's bigger, watch the video, become friends with the owner, build your way up in the ways of the myth, join the discord servers, while of course keeping your real identity a secret. When I made games on an alternative account named Quemian, I just wanted to be accepted as a real myth, just like him. But I got no wood, so I quit. But I just wouldn't get accepted as a real myth. I'd just be a bit of a joke. No matter how hard I'd build my game, no matter how hard I'd put the game in, I just wouldn't be accepted. Until eventually, I gave up. And I started playing on my main account again. Because I missed the thrill of playing. 
And that is why I don't like picking on people who are small myths trying to get big. They wanna be taken seriously. You gotta take them seriously, but you also gotta joke a bit. You also gotta fool around a bit or else your video's gonna be annoying. Or not annoying, more of a boring, but annoying at that. Or well, there is one way you can be annoying in a video, and that is to be Guava Juice. The most annoying YouTuber out there. But I don't have the right to talk about that stuff. Oh, sick mask. Okay, bye!